Shinobi vlog. Just at the gym. Summer's arrived. And uh, so have the tourists. And my usual view of the, the beautiful uh, pill has now turned into the view with the uh, beautiful people. Oh, I mean, not so beautiful people. Saturday night's coming up. The biggest night in MMA history. Well, Irish MMA history. But in anyone that's been involved along the years, it's a huge night. Not because, you know, we've got the main card, but just because we've got four fighters on it. And all that years and years of hard work that people have put in, it's finally shown its head in a manifestation of the UFC in Dublin. And if you haven't seen the, uh, the countdowns, they're brilliant. And uh, Mr. McGregor doesn't disappoint. So he's made for this. He's been born to do this. And uh, I'm just so excited. Problem is, I ain't gonna be there. I was talking to uh, the BJJ Lebowski the other day and he was expecting me to be there, but it's not gonna happen this time. I was trying to get there and do some filming. Uh, we're gonna do a documentary, but the UFC ain't having it. So, gonna have to watch it in the inside out. So, all I wanna do is just not do fight pred pred predictions at all, because the fact that it's there and it's happened is the victory in itself. And the amount of lives that it's gonna continue to change afterwards is the victory in itself. But just, I'd like to say a thank you to the guys that have got it here. Now, the likes of John Cabner, the likes of Andy Ryan that have put in endless hours. I know like, since I've been here about five years, uh, I've kind of an idea what a thankless job is coaching sometimes. And the hours that you put in and the times you don't want to go and open up the gym and you do. Like, you know, compare that to John Cabner or Andy Ryan and all that hassle that you got to deal with and that. But, on a positive note, that they've stuck with it, that they've brought guys along, and uh, the right guys walked in the gym. So we've got Paddy Houlihan's fight. Delighted for Paddy, the guy that puts in hours and hours of work with. Guys on their first class, I saw him when I was over there first hand, he's brilliant. Very busy classes, teaching guys how to be martial artists, how to be better people. He's got a shot, the last time he was there, he was in the ultimate fighter, and he got a wrestle fucked by some American. And anyway, he gets another shot of things. Then we've got Carl Pendred, fresh off the ultimate fighter. And Carl is gonna have a great fight against one of the housemates that he had before. And we've also got Neil Siri, the killer himself. Hard working man, the hardest working man. Huh? And uh, I'm delighted for Neil. Neil was here as well, and he's a great guy. I couldn't be happier for him. Just a down to air to ordinary fella, you know? And he's gonna get in there and he's gonna scrap. That's what people wanna see. Bums on seats. The new daddy himself, Gunnar Nelson. One of my favorite human beings in sport and cat. And uh, he's been down here playing on the rocks as well. So, yeah, I don't know, it's, you know, it looks beautiful here. You can see the beaches here, it's full of people. Beautiful waters. But there's one place I'd like to be on Saturday night, and that's in Dublin, not here. And it's not about places, it's about people, you know, and, and the people you surround yourself with. Yeah, it's good to come to a place like this, but it's also to be in, great to be in a place like the O2 on Saturday night. And then finally, the man himself, Conor McGregor, who's just turned into this superstar. And I say that with, you know, a true meaning of the word superstar, like the guy is a phenom. And uh, to any of the doubters, you will see on Saturday night what the man is capable of. And uh, he's just there to shine, he's a killer. But he's also a superb athlete. And he's got a superb personality. There's no one in the UFC like him that has all three different things. You know, you, you Chael Sonnen, who's a great talker, not great to watch. Anderson Silva, great fighter, horrible to listen to. But you've got the McGregor fella who's got everything going for him. Good looking man, stylish as they come, gifted a gab and he is smooth as silk to watch. 
If you ever want to be a fighter, if you're starting off and you're getting into MMA, watch the way that man moves because it's something of beauty. So, anyway, I'm just going to send some love and some positive vibes from beautiful Lagos. And uh, I'll be watching the fight with a few of the guys in, in Inside and Out, Sosa's bar in town. And uh, if you've been over here, you've frequented that spot. And uh, yeah, I wish I could be there, but it ain't gonna be. We'll be there in spirit. And I'm looking forward to seeing the boys perform. And the victory, like I say, is the fact of what's become of people that have started MMA, what's become of the people that have developed, and how they pass it on. And uh, it's just one of those nights, it's, it's gonna be one to remember. So, I'll be there watching it. So, for the next one, hashtag Rafter. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done already. And if you've any ideas for videos you wanna see, give me a shout and we'll stick them up. Okay, for the next one, Rafter.